The debate over abortion raises the question of when life begins. Well, in the wake of the Roe v. Wade decision from the Supreme Court, one pregnant mother is going viral, and that's because she says her unborn baby girl should count as a valid second passenger in an HOV lane. That's the argument she's using to try to get out of a ticket. But she told our reporter, Jovin Paniker, it wasn't her intention to take a political stand. Brandy Batone was 34 weeks along when she alone took the high occupancy vehicle or HOV lane on Highway 75 in Dallas County. When pulled over by a DPS officer and asked who else is in the car. I was like, oh, this. <laughs> I was like, right here, here she is. And he just kind of looked at me like, uh, do, how do I answer this? Brandy in the moment wasn't trying to take a stand, only trying to fight a ticket. For context, Roe v. Wade had just been overturned and Texas has an impending ban on abortions. She felt it right to think the child she's carrying is a passenger. One lost saying that it's a baby and now he's telling me that this baby that's jabbing my ribs is not a baby. Um, how, like, why can't we, why can't it all make sense? The officer wasn't buying it. Brandy got a $275 ticket for an HOV violation. Man, it's two people outside of the body, which, weird way of wording it. TxDOT's online description of the HOV rule isn't entirely clear. It reads simply, a vehicle occupied by two or more people. Even the officer admitted she could fight it. Hundreds, thousands of people on social media feel that too. Just the outpour of support from, gosh, women all over the world. All sorts of emotions. I'm trying to obviously keep my blood pressure down. Let's not go into labor yet. Brandy says she's taking a neutral stance politically. In the last two days, she's heard from both sides of the abortion debate. What she will say is this. If there's a pro-women <laughs> category, that's, I, that's, that's my stance. Now at 36 weeks along, she has hired an attorney and has a court date in late July. That is, if her daughter doesn't come first. In Collin County, I'm Joe